When you look at the polling data, illegal immigration is a major issue for voters going to the polls this November. Looking into this, of course, is Emma Withrow from the Fact Check team. Now, you dug into some federal data regarding immigration. What did you find out? I did. It's really interesting when I looked into this. The U.S. Department of Homeland Security just released new data on illegal immigrants living in the U.S. from January 2018 to January 2022. So it's important to note right off the bat that these numbers have definitely grown since this research was done. In 2023, actually, Customs and Border Patrol were reported 3.2 million illegal crossings nationwide. This report estimates there are around 11 million illegal immigrants living in the U.S. in 2022, which was up from 10.5 million in 2021, which ended a long-term decline that had lasted from 07 to 2019. Now, when we talk about illegal immigration and people coming over here from the U.S. crossing the border illegally, now, is this the most we've ever seen living in the U.S. right now? Yeah, so when I looked at the data, it shows that that's not the most that we've ever seen. According to Homeland Security, the peak of illegal immigrants in the U.S. actually happened in 2007 with 12.2 million. But like I said before, more recent data would definitely paint a different picture. So we're going to have to wait until that comes out to really get a better feel for it. And we will be looking forward to getting that information. Thanks so much, Emma. Thanks. Later on, Emma will be back to break down the impact um, illegal immigration has on the U.S. workforce.